from gathered in the rain tonight to learn about a proposed high-density condo development and raise concerns. News specialist Andrew Adams is live from the site of the planned project at 400 West and 1600 North. Andrew? Dave, dozens turned out on an evening where, frankly, it would have been warmer and drier just to stay indoors. There are significant uh, the concerns over this development. They say it's just too big and ambitious for this neighborhood. So we began developing plans for that project last fall. Just off of 1600 North. Yeah, and then if I can get through it, then I will take the questions when I get through it. This parking lot became a popular detour. So there's lots and lots of people in the that have no idea this is happening. On the table was a petition over new development slated to be built in two years. So the petition is specifically focusing on the traffic. So we're trying to use that angle to try and stop the development or at least get the city to seriously take a second look at it. As those involved laid out the plans for the six-story building. There's a diagram where we have tried to lay out the distances and the dimensions. Neighbors voiced their objections. Do you really think they're going to go up here and do a U-turn and all? No. I think it's completely irresponsible to build something that large here on such a small lot, and uh, it's it's extremely worrisome, especially as far as the traffic goes. The developer believes the traffic orders are overblown. This is 55 units or less with underground parking with two access. Studies we saw said that if you put a retail in here, you'd have more traffic. Dennis O'Brien well, says he hopes to change minds as Orem City inevitably grows. So we're not looking to be the bad guys. We're just trying to do what the city has said to do and asked people to do for over four years now. His design is beautiful. I give him credit for that. Not Neighbors today just weren't sold. I certainly hope it doesn't go in. They'd rather find another way around it. There's just not the facilities or the, the access for ingress and egress that would even permit this to, uh, that is the way in, in my mind, make it flow. Again, neighbors trying to build some momentum against the project. Uh, they, they say they'd like to see something more responsible in size. The developer says, hey, put any kind of fast food drive through here that's popular and see a lot more traffic than what he's proposing. Back to you. With housing prices doing what they're doing, it'll be interesting to see what happens with this project. Andrew Adams in Orem tonight. Thanks, Andrew.